Hello guys, uh, again another replay sent to me by Luvatar. This time I think I am playing in this one, I'm uh, his opponent. I don't remember the, the game quite well. Uh, we'll just have uh, to see how this goes. We've got Luvatar here, his goblins. We've got uh, Mohendis Bay, this is Donatello once again. He's Mordor and Black Knight, he's also Mordor. And yeah, I think I remember my teammates. We've got uh, um, uh, dwarves, Papillon is Isengard, and we've got uh, Sidious here, he's uh, elves. You saw earlier Sidious made a signal to us here. I think he wanted us to attack, I, I, he wanted me to attack. You can see me, I uh, have chosen, when I'm Dwarves in 3 vs 3, I'm starting with the first Fortress upgrade, it only costs 500 but gives you 10% discount on Heroes and also 20% uh, discount on Builders, so Builders cost uh, 400 instead of 500 and Heroes get 10% uh, discount. Also all troops that are around your fort have leadership. So this is a very good upgrade fort uh, and uh, it only costs 500 and it also it uh, builds itself very quickly so I choose to start with it most of the times and in 3 versus 3 and then click Gloin. Yeah those guys are two Mordor. I only have one unit of archers and one more coming in but uh, thankfully Sidious has sent his Lego to help me. So one uh, fell beast is dead. Black Knight is drawn back his uh, his fell beast. So yeah, I don't believe I would have managed to save my fort without Sidious' help. Sidious was very smart playing uh, like this, he just sent his Lego straight to my fort. He knew that uh, two Mordor would, would attack me, simply because uh, dwarves don't have such strong archers. So it was a good start, killing one fell beast. Hunting away the other one. I try to move my uh, units uh, slowly, you know, I just don't like uh, sending, uh, sending the builder far away to make a farm somewhere away from my uh, base, simply because one of our opponents is, uh, two of our opponents is Mordor, there is one fell beast, the other one is uh, Goblins. So there are great chances that uh, my builder will uh, die. And here we were very fortunate, we managed to kill uh, the second fell beast. So game looks very good from our side. So I try to with dwarves just uh, 
make, us, make some spearmen, make some archers to kill goblins and uh, move my builders up front somewhere around here for start, capture that flag then somewhere around here maybe and then eventually here at his fort and uh, upload troops and attack his fort right away this was my plan, of course with goblins it's extremely difficult to do this as you can see I had nearly lost my glory by simply two goblin warriors this is why I'm saying uh, goblins are amazing against uh, enemy heroes those little goblins cost only 75 and uh, look at how much damage they do to they did to my loin. So I decided to move back and hold this uh, narrower here. You can defend more easily. Bad thing uh, is that uh, Sidious is not pushing at all uh, Black Knight. He doesn't even put any pressure. I mean, he should have taken control of this area and uh, also using this in. I mean, it's a lot harder for me to use this in because uh, my opponent is uh, goblins and I am dwarves. But his men, his opponent is uh, Mordor. He could make two barracks here, a tower here maybe, with some heroic statues and uh, a healing well. And take control of this inn and then slowly attack his opponent's base with some elven sword maybe. As you can see, uh, Illuvatar is putting a lot of pressure. Now that I see the game more relaxed, I do realize that uh, maybe I should have built some battle wagons that would help me kill uh, those little goblins faster and also uh, send my spearmen straight for his uh, spider riders. Um, and yeah, basically. Donatello sees that I'm making some defense here and I don't have much army back at my fort so he's sending some orcs in my base Of course my teammates helped me a lot here they sent two archers and one cavalry unit But Iluvatar keeps pressing me from this side, I can't uh, leave this side uh, unprotected and as you can see I'm having a lot of trouble. But at this point, uh, Illuvatar doesn't allow me to attack or maybe uh, help my teammates defend. I'm just stuck there, you know, I can't do anything. I uh, decided to make a, a tower at this point. 
so I can protect my archers a lot better. But here Black Knight has two fell beasts. Uh, I think, yeah, I'm just using my heal structure. I sent some of my archers here to help Papillon, but unfortunately it was too late. Here come some of my spearmen help against the spider riders. So we managed to kill uh, most of their troops, but Papillon lost uh, his uh, fort and now I'm facing an attack from Mordor. I'm not ready to face this attack, I don't have many archers yet, only one unit. Look how good Donatello is positioning his uh, troops. There goes my fort as well. So basically in this video you can see how bad idea is uh, to try and defend with dwarves, it's almost impossible and uh, yeah you just uh, will depend on your teammates efforts to push your opponents back and then maybe if they push your opponents back you have a chance to attack. With dwarves it's the best thing to simply attack attack and uh, don't stop attacking. Because if you stop attacking, you will find yourself defending and with Dwarves, it's a very bad idea to try and defend. So here, finally, Sidious is pushing back Black Knight. In my opinion, Sidious should have tried this a long time ago. Very nice play by Luvatar.
it didn't give me any chance at all to defend and uh, have a chance attacking. Yeah, those guys uh, were facing an attack as well from the bottom. Uh, Papillon uh, got uh, defeated and Sidious left the game after that. And then I also left the game, no point of playing alone. Very well played by our opponents. Uh, in my opinion, we, we all three of my, me and my teammates played uh, very bad. Uh, we didn't play any aggressive at all. And uh, this way we didn't put any pressure to our opponents. And when you don't put pressure to your opponents, you are simply facing one attack after another. And yeah, especially in my case, when I was Dwarves, it's always a bad idea, if this is the case. So anyway, it was a good game. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Thank you very much for watching and uh, more videos coming soon.